Hello, it's Bermani with Nature of Art, the art teacher online who has books, curriculum, and art supplies. And I wanted to pop in and show you this fun, inspirational shelf I have staged to introduce the color purple. But I wanted to tell you a little bit more about the mediums and how you could do this to introduce a new color if you're working with early childhood children that are learning their colors. This is really fun. Um, you could do this with older elementary kids, just get a little bit more sophisticated with um, the book and the technique of the color. All right, so what do I have here? I have a classic book called Harold's, Harold and the Purple Crayon. It is a classic. I've had this book for many years and love to use it to introduce color for the first time. Now, if you're using a different color, you can still use this book. It just kind of isolates one color, but you can change the mediums. So here are some things I have in my shelf. I have a little cute container of mediums. I have a paint stick, a marker, two, three types of crayons. Um, I've got a Stockmar, regular Crayola, and then I've got my square block crayons. And then I got a wax color pencil right here. So kids can take this little cute tray and make marks of a color purple, which you are um, focusing on. I've got some cute little pom-poms. I've got some styrofoam and purple. I even have a stamp pad that has purple that kids can use. I've got a purple paintbrush. I've got a dot stamper and my acrylic paint. So it's just a fun way. I wanted to show you how you could stage and introduce colors. Now remember what I said earlier, you can change that, um, you can change the color like to orange, but change all these um, examples and mediums to orange. You can still have the same book out there. I know that younger kids love to hear the same story over and over. You can let the kids try to read it themselves, um, but it doesn't matter if it's purple, it's just talking about an isolated color. So I hope you like that. Um, all these mediums here are for sale on my website, so you can check out my website and um, buy those things there or check out my books. I hope you enjoyed that and love your feedback. Bye.